Auto Dealers is excited to announce the launch of our new user authentication platform, Access Indiana. Access Indiana allows citizens to use one login and one password as a single sign-on to securely access multiple services for the state of Indiana. To get started, click on the blue login button near the top of the Auto Dealers screen. You will be directed to the Access Indiana portal for account creation or login. If you are an existing Access Indiana user, log in using your email and password. Once you have successfully logged in, you will be directed to the Auto Dealers dashboard. If you have accessed the dashboard in the past using the same email address, you will be directed to your existing Auto Dealers dashboard. Auto Dealers users who do not have an Access Indiana account will be required to create an account. This will allow us to link your Auto Dealers and Access Indiana account. As long as you use the email associated to your Auto Dealers account, all of your Auto Dealers information will be saved. To register for an Access Indiana account, select Sign Up for Access Indiana. You will be directed to the Access Indiana Sign Up page to complete account registration. Enter your email address and click Send Verification Code. Make sure to open a new tab in your browser to access your email for the verification code. If you get email on your phone, that is the easiest way to get the verification code. Once you have your verification code, return to the Sign Up tab, enter the code, and click Continue. If you do not see an email in your inbox from the state of Indiana with the subject Access Indiana Email Verification, please check your spam folder. Verify your email address and click Continue. You will be navigated to the Password Creation page. Be sure to reference the right side panel, which provides the minimum password requirements. Your password must include a minimum of eight characters, at least one lowercase character, at least one uppercase character, at least one digit, and at least one of the identified special characters. Enter your password in the Password and Confirm Password fields and click Continue. As you type your password, the requirements on the right side will switch to green and the helper text will disappear once you have met all minimum requirements. Once your password meets the minimum requirements, you will be directed to the profile page where you will enter your name, phone, and organization like so. Click Create Account when you are done entering the information. The system will navigate you to the two-step verification page. While it is not necessary for you to sign up for two-step verification, it is strongly recommended for additional security. If you do not want to sign up for the two-step verification, click No Thanks and select Continue. To sign up, select the Yes Please and select Continue. If you choose to sign up for two-step verification, you will be directed to a screen where you will select how you want to receive the verification code. Choose text message or phone call. Once you have indicated your method of receipt, click continue. A green banner will appear indicating that the code was successfully sent. Enter the code in the verification code text box and select continue. You will be directed to the recovery email page. While it is not required to provide a recovery email, it is strongly encouraged. You can do, use this email in the event that you no longer have access to your primary email account. If you do not wish to provide a recovery email, select the No Thanks radio button and click the Continue button. To set up a recovery email, select the Yes Please radio button and click the Continue button. Enter in a secondary email and click Continue. The system will send the secondary email a verification code. Go to your email to get the code. Again, be sure not to close this tab to access your email. Open your email in a different tab or from your mobile device and then return to this tab to enter the verification code. Click the Continue button. Once complete, you will be directed to the Auto Dealers dashboard.